Hello everyone, today we are playing Robin Hood, Prince of Thieves. <laughs> I can't keep that up. I can only imagine the number of people that uh, turned off this Let's Play already because of my horrible Cognate accent. Or whatever I was trying to do. Uh, today we are playing Robin Hood, Prince of Thieves, starring Kevin Costner. And uh, let's get into it. New game. So the backstory, we're in Jerusalem, 1194, year of our Lord, third year of the Third Crusade. The setting, Arab Dungeons, Sunset. Okay. My friend's getting crap. Actually, looks like the guy's kind of taunting him from a distance with that axe, but I guess he's being tortured. So we can take our time. Talk to him. Help me, Robin. I can't hold out any longer. I think I'm going to go in and out of the voice. So, kill the dick who's beating up your friend. Alright. Free at last! Not unless we get out of here. Lead the way. I'll try to keep up. Alright. Peter. My very modest band. Me and a cripple. Alright, so we have our little menu system here. This game's, this game's pretty cool, actually. A lot of people probably remember the movie. And the parody of the movie. And the story and everything of Robin Hood. But... They might not remember the Nintendo game. So, uh, there's a lot we can do. First, we can find this hidden key. Alright. So I searched the guard, I found a key. Lock the door with the door key. This guy will join us up too. This is a uh, Aziz, I believe, or Azim. Azim, I'm sorry. Don't. We're all dead men. Well, I guess you could say no and he wouldn't join you, but that would suck. Azim, yeah. A sneeze. <laughs> I remember a lot more from the Mel Brooks parody than the actual movie. Alright, good to know. So just be searching everywhere. Search, it'll just appear so you can just hover on top of it. See if there's any more crap around here. Oops. <laughs> He's in an air prison. Nothing of interest. Alright. Alright. Trying to relearn how to play this. Alright. We can open this door now. And fight this guy. Ow! To die, infidel. So I guess that guy got locked out, which is embarrassing. He's never gonna kick his ass. It's a little trick I learned. See, so yeah, this game is multifaceted. Sweet little somersaults, but yeah, so we, there's like these little battle things, Street Fighter style. I guess he's not gonna jump up here, so this could be one of the more difficult fights since we can't cheat. Keep him at bay, though. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. Turbo is our friend. Just keep poking him until he gives up. <laughs> By which I mean he dies. Stab, 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 stab. Yeah. Just jumps off the screen. That's how you know you killed someone. Just like in real life. Oh, was defeated. All right. So I'm gonna say there's uh, maybe some bread or something we can find around here. Maybe not. All right, let's just get out of here. So this is the hidden exit, as the theme told us. Oh, this is our menu system. We don't need to mess with that right now. All right. Let's move quickly. They will come after us. All right. I'm not sure it's supposed to be pitch black here, actually, but... So when they leave behind a body, then there's something you can search on them. Sometimes they have multiple objects on them. This guy does not. Yeah, there should be, like, water. We're in, like, a sewer right now. You should be able to see water. The game's probably glitching out. 
band-aids. <laughs> yes, they had band-aids in 1136. Shame on you for asking. Gold, I think, gets translated into uh, arrows. Pretty sure. I think there's a supplement around here. Yeah, it's really annoying that this is glitching out like this. Ah, crap! <laughs> My ass kicked. Getting your ass kicked. It's time to apply some band-aids. And eat some bread. Bread cures open wounds. As everyone knows, Peter has nothing. Azim has nothing. Alright, so we gotta be careful moving forward. Oh, the more dudes you kill, the more experience you get. And you actually do level up, which is kind of nice. So you get stronger. So this isn't a bad place to kill dudes if I hadn't just gotten destroyed. Just gotta be careful. The angles they take as they approach you. Because I'm pretty low on HP. Die. Dudes hanging out in the sewer. I don't know if this is one of those situations where I get my health back. Apple. I'll eat that right now. Get my agility back. As I carry less crap. now. Oh, sweet. Love sewer water bread. Bread that's been soaked in sewer water. There we go, there's one of those supplements I was talking about. It's like a little seed or potion or something, I guess. Oops. So I'm gonna hold on to that for now. I can eat this bread, I guess. Yeah, the potion's nice. Gives you back, like, at least 50 hit points, so... Let's see what this dude dropped. Some gold coins... Rob grasps the gold coins. <laughs> so dramatic. Right. This is annoying that I can't see anything, so I don't really know where the opening is. There's a Ravnikos! Fight for your lives! This is sweet, so you get this overhead kind of free-for-all battle here. Don't really you have your little health bar down at the bottom. You can switch off dudes, I want to say, too. Yeah, let's start. So if you like, uh... If you prefer one of the other dudes. I like... I guess this is the theme in the white. I like the way he uh, swings. So even if no one gets hurt in the actual battle, Peter is always gets messed up there. Right. So Peter's dead. Let's go make a sacrifice and act upon him. He just wants to get the hell out of here. Alright. Now we can escape to the north. Our ten-month journey fraught with peril. We at last reached the shores of England. Ah, right, there we go. Let's talk to this commoner. Hello, young man. Yeah, Sheriff Rottingham has taken over. 
and he's been a dick, apparently, according to the villager. So we can grab this quiver. Explore the, uh, the area here. Pick another quiver for another dude. There's a key of some sort. Another quiver. Maybe these are just arrows. Maybe it's just a bundle of arrows. I don't know. Doesn't matter. I don't usually use arrows. Sweet. More drugs. This is a good place to, uh... Actually, I don't know. Are there any dudes here? Yeah. This is a good place to kill dudes, nice and safe. Oh, there we go. There's the bow. Right, so we'll have to fight that guy in a second, but let's see if there's anything else over here. Shit. Crap, so you're not supposed to go that way. Alright, whatever. Oh, watch out for arrow dudes. That was a dumb decision to go over to the left. Zeem is, for all intents and purposes, dead for the moment. We're on our own. Watch out for those arrow guys. You just get cut down if you're, uh... Jeez, how many dudes are there? I made a mistake, my gosh. Let's walk off. not controlling your friends, they're kind of stupid, and they just run into uh, arrows as they're being shot at them, so they die pretty quickly. Uh, I'm pretty sure there's not supposed to be this many guys. <laughs> Alright. There we go. I think that's more guys than you ever fight in one of these battles, even when you have like five friends with you. That was kind of glitching out. Azim's dead. Alright, so let's not go that way. Let's take some drugs, actually. I think we eat it. Just put it under your tongue. There we go, full health, just like that. Right, let's kick this guy's ass, whoever he is. Ah! Sheriff's cousin. Kill him, man. So, <laughs> not one of these stupid things. Yeah, Zim has no health, by the way, when he comes back. He's at zero. Oh, shit. See, look at that. It's like 20 guys this time. chest. We got this sweet key. Where is it? Here it is. Yay! Red potion. So we have to pick up the red potion, by the way. Alright, let's pop on that body armor. There we go. See that defense? Go up from, uh, three. From zero to three. All right, so we have a bone arrow. We can pop this in his hand right now. We can use this during a fight. Actually, the sword probably be better for him. So we can have a secondary attack, but it's kind of useless. So it's not like we can use both at once. Or maybe we can, but the sword's fine. Um, he's fine. I don't mind that he's almost dead. Wear this or something. Actually, no, that's a waste. It doesn't make sense at all. Alright. So there's a dude in this tree. I don't know if you can see him. Go over to the side to talk to him. Thanks for saving me from Nottingham. 
Nottingham's men. They're talking. This is my land. They have no business here. You obviously don't know Nottingham. My father, John Little. What's up? Uh, I skipped that. Oh well. Bye, Loxley. Alright, see you, kid. Alright, so now we can go to the left without onslaughts of men coming in. Can you use onslaught? Button I have on turbo here. More gold. Good times. So yeah, maybe I'll kill some dudes while I'm here. So you can. And maybe I'll pause the video here while I go up a couple levels, spare you from having to watch the grinding. It's not that much compared to other games, but uh, let's at least get to level 3, and we'll, we'll pick it up from there. Alright, so see you guys in a second. Alright, so I uh, I got kind of carried away. I said I was going to level 3, I ended up going all the way to level 8. So I've apparently max hit points at 250, you can't get any more than that. And, um, my defense is amazing. Dudes are just, like, bouncing off of me. My attack is off the charts. I, li I look at a guy and he kind of disintegrates. It's pretty cool. And I'm fast as hell. Like, normally you have to take one of these little red, uh, PEDs to, like, get some extra speed. But now, I'm just so beefy and so awesome. This is how fast I run normally. Just, yeah, it's awesome. Alright, so we go. Die. All right. So that's that didn't even take that long. That was like 20 minutes, 25 maybe tops. Real bad. This is uh, I guess Robin's house. Oxley Castle in ruins. There are evil forces in this land. Father, where are you? that up there. <laughs> yeah, it's something wrong with these uh, interior places. For some reason the graphics are all dark. Anyway. That could be a problem actually moving forward if I can't see something that I need to find. I need to grab. doing one damage to me as they run into me and die. <laughs> Good times. Gold. Hey, there he is. Duncan, are you a sort for sore eyes? Don't you about Duncan, my father. Master Robin, you're here. It's a miracle. Are you dead, Duncan? Now we got Duncan. Um, he is blind, but somehow he manages to be a pretty decent fighter in the field. You have to watch him though, because if you're not careful, he will equip a leg of lamb as his weapon. I mean, he's blind. Cut the guy a break. So, I guess it's safe to give him a dagger. Maybe the leg of lamb was a better choice, but I'm sure he won't kill one of us accidentally. Let's. Let's pop this on, see what it does. Drops the uh, the defense down a few pegs. But it lightens my load. And I think I need to wear this actually for the next part, but then I can pop the armor back on. Some, uh, some bread, some more quivers. Bolt out of here. Yep. That is sad. 
I like that music though. Alright. Alright, so now we've taken care of that business, we can take off. It's just arrows lying all over the place. So this is really stupid. You would be able to go through here, but the game can't recognize 3D objects or basic physics, so. Alright, see the sweet escape music on the way. Die. I don't even care. And the dagger is handy. Peter and his sister. Marion Dubois. <laughs> Can't get over how fast I am. I love this. I keep making sounds like that. What's up, buddy? Yeah, you gotta wear that stupid chain. Otherwise, they'll let you in. Now that they've recognized us, we can pop our armor back on and go back to being invincible. Eat some bread. Since I'm not at full health. Close enough. There we go. Ba -da 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 -da. Fuck off. A tomato, a potato. Door is locked. Thanks, crazy old woman. Sweet, more drugs. Love those drugs. Alright, need a key for that west room. More drugs, I love it! armor I was looking for. Let's pop that on. Just got it. Dunk it. Alright, let's see. So we go from 17 to 20. Nice. We can pop this on a Zeem now. And might as well give Duncan some bling. And I think it's a good idea to give the blind guy a second dagger. How about you? Alright. Looking pretty good on potions and meat and bread. So, Marion? Shouldn't seem to be freaking out that I put him back or whatever. Sweet. Guy and his men take my saddle. Pretend to steal two horses and flee, or they'll kill us all. Except we do steal two horses. Oh, uh, pretend to steal. All right, so do I have the? Uh, there we go. Pretend to steal. I don't know why we have to do that. Why can't we just take two horses? Die. I can run faster than the horses. Let's get a shape in. I'm in. That's fine. So get next to the horses, equip the uh, the saddle, and then quick quick use. Frantically. Saddle up on horses. We must ride or die. At least in the forest. If we make it there. All right. So this is kind of annoying because I did all that trouble leveling up and everything, but if I fall here on one of these rocks, I think I'm gonna. It's like all over. So I have to be very careful. Or I'll go ape shit. Shit. Ride or die. Alright. After a long horse chase, you managed to elude the guards in Sherwood Forest. Good times. Well said, Robin. I might use that one if I ever find myself in haunted woods. Alright, so we can race around here, killing things as they run into us. Find more sweet webs. Hopefully I'm not missing any sweet potions or anything. Me 
Yeah, you have to be on level 3 minimum, I think, to be able to wear the armor that you find that Marion uh, has on her table there. I think there's something down here. Oh, yeah. Red one, I'll take it. Man, I'm kind of worried how fast I'll be going if I uh, pop one of those red pills. Well, well, a rich man has come to visit us. <laughs> Welcome to John Little Forest, my dick. I have no money for the likes of you. Then I suppose that gold medallion around your neck is worth that around Duncan's neck, actually. It was my father's. It is sacred to me. Sacred to us too, mush. <laughs> that there will be feeding us for a bloomin' month. By a bloomin' honey. Since you won't pay a toll, we ain't got no rolls. Yeah. Watch out, Dad. He walloped the shit. He kicked the shit out of the sheriff's men. Alright, so this is... This is pretty funny. So just hop... Uh, right down here, beside the tree trunk. And let him run into your sword like an idiot. This just takes a while. Not challenging. <laughs> like the Robin locomotive move. If I get bored. Come on. Die. I have like 300 health. I'm level 8, bitch. Oh, this is even better. There we go. <laughs> yes, please. Good times. The scene exactly the Mississippi. <laughs> or should I call you Little John? <laughs> what an asshole Robin is. Best sword work I've seen in a long time. The way you hid behind that rock. Now we're doing errands for this guy, basically. Kind of reminds me of that guy that was, uh... Lloyd Braun or something from Seinfeld, I don't know. Or Robert Stack, maybe? I'm getting a Robert Stack vibe from this guy. Stopping on what I can do on my map be an easy task. If I wasn't level 8. <laughs> I've seen the letter from the Baron that describes an evil plot. Alright, so we're running errands for this guy for, uh, like, the next six missions, basically. I killed a lot of guys earlier when I was leveling up. It was kind of ridiculous. Like, the game should technically be over. Because there is there shouldn't be an army left to fight. <laughs> Got, like, a thousand guys. Alright. Dynasty Warriors totals, basically. I love being fast. Da -da -da. Really fast. Let's navigate your way through there, and at the bottom you'll find the church where the evil baron is getting married. Grab some cash if you're into it. I don't care. So we have to find this letter first. We can talk to this. Looks like she's, I don't know, on her knees licking out of a bowl or something? I don't know. There's an upstairs area somewhere here. Where is it? Tomato, hot potato. Don't mind me.
hell's he upstairs? This money must not be held! <laughs> oh. Stab you in the back. Sheesh! Where's the upstairs? in a battle here. Oh man, my men are... Quit running into the frickin' arrows, you morons! Get that guy! There you go. Yeah, that's what's up. Got my ass kicked, apparently. 43. Sucks. Need some protein. For this fight. <laughs> John came prepared. Bag full of bandages. Chamber. There it is. Oh, oh. He just killed his friend. Grab some meat while I'm here. These guys are all equipped with crossbows. The problem with these little uh, overhead battles, little melee sessions, is that uh, all the damage I take is multiplied versus out here. Alright, I got your damn note. On guard. So remember our tactic that we used on Little John earlier? Same thing goes for this guy. Just hide behind a table and give him severe and chronic joint pain in the legs for the rest of his life. Let me show you this. <laughs> If you have Turbo A and you hold up, it's like he's trying to jump, but he doesn't jump. He just looks like a little Robin Hood express train or something. Looks pretty silly. Just bounce off the things. It's a good time. Come on, man. Let's do this. Quit showing off. Do like ten flips in air, that's pretty sweet. That's a lot of somersaults in the air. Finish this like a man. Backtrack your way. 
Back through the forest. Take shape. And we got a huge wild boar to kill. It's a day in the life. So you got that's not the wild boar by the way, that's like a that's a baby compared to what we're hunting. You probably take some meat or something. You can toss this stupid letter now. More band-aids. It's our potion man. What's it look like? Like a meat. Don't know what I was expecting there. Alright. So I dropped there's all the crap I just dropped. So we gotta go find the boar's den. I think it's up all the way up top. Nope. Next one down, I think. So this is kind of cool. You can actually... There's a bunch of stuff hidden over here in this corner. And you can actually... Oh, I guess I can't reach it from here. Yeah, it's all near the boar. You can run up here, grab all that crap, and then equip everything you need so you can put on even better armor we just found. So we go up from 20 to 23. Pop this on a zine. We'll give this to Lil John. I think Duncan's happy with his bling. And then where's the Loxley bow? Is this it? You have to take a look at him. There we go. So pop that on. And now I got a ton of arrows. I just best thing to use on this guy. Make sure you stay away from the door, though, because he'll force you out. Just keep tearing into him with the bow. He goes down pretty quickly. Die, bitch. That was easy. Good times. Alright. Went through a good number of arrows there, but... Get a better sword here soon. I think that's all that's in here. Oh, coins. Alright. Cool. Sorry guys, killed your mom. We will have our revenge! Robin Hood 2! The search for more money. You can see we, we can actually go in these little hunts now. Kind of cool. I think one of these has some, uh, oh yeah, that's what I was looking for. <laughs> Alright. Maybe another one? Arrows. Well, someone burns them to the ground. Uh, <laughs> a little foreshadowing there. Alright, one of our woodsmen went south for a short errand and never returned. Good luck! I'll stay here and do nothing. 